I am Anil Kumar and in this video we will learn how to use compound angle formula to evaluate trigonometric ratios for different angles. So we need to find exact value of tan of 105. So tan 105 degrees. 105 could be written as 60 plus 45, right? So we could write this as 60 degrees plus 45 degrees, correct? Now, now we can apply the compound angle formula and expand this. So when you expand this, what do you get? You get tan of 60 degrees plus tan of 45 degrees divided by 1 minus tan 60 degrees times tan 45 degrees. Correct? So that is how you can expand it using the compound angle formula. Now some of you can use special triangles to write down the exact values for uh, 45 and uh, 60 degrees. The exact values 60 degrees triangle will be 1 2 square root 3 and the 45 degrees is 1 1 square root 2 correct. So we can use these values correct. So we know tan of 105 degrees could now be written as tan 60 60 is opposite over adjacent side square root 3 so we can write square root 3 plus tan of 45 is just 1 okay divided by 1 minus square root 3 times 1 which is square root 3 now whenever you get answer like this you should rationalize so let me share with you the technique of rationalization so it is square root 3 plus 1 divided by 1 minus square root 3 so rationalization means multiplying by this conjugate which is 1 plus square root 3. Now it is important to understand this because in multiple choice questions you may not have that choice right. So let us multiply both numerator and denominator by conjugate of denominator which is 1 plus square root 3. It is multiplying by 1 which you can always do. So let's expand. It's like a plus b whole square. So we get square root 3 square which is 3 plus 2ab that is 2 square root 3 plus 1 square root square of 1. Denominator will be 1 square minus square root of square root 3 which is 3. Correct? So that is what you get in the denominator. Now you can simplify 3 plus 1 is 4. 4 plus 2 square root 3 divided by minus 2. Right? So divide by minus 2. So you can divide both by 2 now because you can see right like this. 2 as a common factor, 2 plus square root 3 divided by minus 2. So that gives you minus 2 plus square root 3. Is it okay? So that is your answer, correct, for tan of 105 degrees. Now we used compound angle formula to find this answer. I would like you to take this question as a test now figure out what is cos of 105 degrees and what is sine of 105 degrees, right? Find that out and check if their ratio gives you the same answer or not. I hope that helps. Thank you and all the best.